Here's a little update on my new graphics card. My 1070 Ti 8 gigabyte GeoForce, the NVIDIA card of MSI Aero came in. Yeah, that's a lot of words. All right, I could not install it in my computer right now. It's the smaller version because my computer is a miniature sized um, compact computer. So it only has a one slot card, not the two or three fans. It's a smaller card, so it took a long time to find it, and it cost double the price because of the graphics card's issues. My problem is, see that has an eight pin connector? My motherboard only has a six pin connector. And the old card, the 1060 three gigabyte, only has a six pin connector. So these last two pins here are just grounds. This is power, 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 ground, 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 and then ground, ground. Well, you need to ground those. You can't just plug in the set. You can physically plug it in so that these six pins are the only ones connecting and leave these completely undone, but then you're not grounding them. This needs to be ground. These two pins are there to be grounded for a reason. They have to be grounded. So I watched a video, blah, blah, blah. You can just do it yourself, or I found a place on Amazon here they make these. It's six pin to eight pin, and it comes with the jumper. The last two pins over here are just grounds. So it brings them over and then it grounds it inside and does the soldering for you and stuff. I don't have to mutilate a, a, and try to create something. This is already done, already ready to go. So it's like 17 bucks. It'll be here on Sunday, then I can install it. Then, of course, the next question is, well, will your motherboard be able to supply an eight pin graphics card on only a six pin off your motherboard that seems like it's underpowered then right well then that's this is what i used from the beginning this is msi's trident 3 eighth generation my computer uh, from msi's website and it says these are my options the GTX 1050, 1050, this one, this was the one I have right now, the 3G. I'm gonna be going from three gigabytes to six gigabytes and the faster processor, everything else. But this, these are the options that the manufacturer says my computer can run. Of course, it would have been nice if they would have said over here, must get a six to eight adapter cable because it's an eight pin connector. <laughs> It would have been kind of helpful. But anyway, so I gotta wait a couple days and then when that comes in, out with the old card, in with the new card, in with the new adapter wire, and then we'll see if we can get this thing upgraded.